So on Twitter, you have a Twitter. Yes. Um, what's the silliest thing anyone has ever tweeted to you, or anything that's like really got your attention? I've had some weird things tweeted at me. <laughs> um, I can't remember. <sighs> have there been any that you're like, I have to respond to that? I, you know, it has happened on occasion. A lot of them, I, I, I really, really, really try to respond to the the, the very, very witty ones. Like, there's there's incredibly, incredibly witty people. On, on my Twitter, I'm very lucky to have good fans. Um, and they'll respond, so I'll respond back to them. But I've had some really weird guys <laughs> and people be on my Twitter, which is really, it's, it's actually mostly fun. There's this one girl who, who, um, who tw just like tweets inappropriate things at me all day. And it's very interesting. It's, it's, like, it's, like, a, it's like a job. It's very, it's very interesting, but it's fun. It's very fun. Hey, and uh, is there anyone on Twitter that you wish would follow you back? Um, I don't know. I follow like I use like for my feed. Like I just follow people who I want to like. Like I like I want to like get news from. Like say like um, like I follow the New York Times. I follow the GSAs. I follow like a bunch of like other like I follow my friends, seeing what they're doing. Like that's like that's kind of why I use it. I don't mind if people follow me or not. You know, it's very nice when they do. It's it's like it's, it's very like you know humbling that people want to follow me. But it's nice to like just to. I don't know, to, to know what's going on in the world, because that's how people get their news now. Sure, They're, sure. And um, again, switching gears, what, is, what was your first big splurge when you first bought something that you were like, I'm going to buy this for myself? I think it's pretty common, but I bought a guitar. Um, I bought a guitar, and um, I did like adult things. I got a car with car insurance, and I got health care. Like, I'm, because I'm from Canada, we don't have, like, we have free healthcare, so I moved to the States, I'm like, I'm going to spend my money on health. So, <laughs> there you go. I don't want to... Becoming wanna an adult. Like an arm and <laughs> not be able to get it fixed. And um, if you were to give yourself and the cast, like, superlatives, like, most likely twos or whatever, what would you give yourself? That's a great word, superlative. Isn't it? Yeah, it's fantastic. Um, most likely to... We'll, s know. we'll start with hard. okay. We'll start with someone else. Yeah. Uh, Victoria. Victoria. Uh, oh, this is all very hard. I know. Most likely to. Um, okay, so this is mostly this is a weird. Thing. She's a weird laugh. She's uh, this is like this stuff, it's got nothing to do with what you're asking. Okay. Me. This is a complete segue. But she's got this thing where her fake her her real laugh sounds like a fake laugh. She be like <laughs> like she doesn't like laugh like she doesn't laugh like. She, when she's genuinely laughing, it's, it's very, like, like, a, <laughs> like, sounds fake. That's, a, that's the story I have to tell you. It's got nothing to do with what you're talking so about. So she's most likely to laugh fake. No, because that's <laughs> not true, because she's really genuinely laughing. Okay, I, I, we'll I, just, we'll just... The relatives are really hard. <laughs> They're so hard. Okay, well then we'll move, we'll do one more and then we'll move on. Okay. Okay, What's, who would be an easy one? Would Matt be an easy one? Matt would be. Okay, most likely to... Most likely to get naked at some point during the day, probably. Oh, okay, that's a good one. <laughs> He's the most likely to do that. And um, what is the most important quality in a girlfriend? Um, humor, I think. Humor, humor. and um, humor and um, acceptance of who you are. I think that's a huge thing that people don't really mention a lot. Is it you know like it's not just you know. Because it's not just about her qualities, it's about how she appreciates your qualities, does it make sense? Right. Like, or, you know, like, and she sees your qualities and she's like, I like that, and even though that's not a good quality of you, I can figure out a way of appreciating it for myself. Or like, or, you know, or I can help you get better at this. Sure. That's a, that's a, that's a, that's a big thing for me, I think. And who is your dream leading lady? I've said this a thousand times, but it's <laughs> amazingly true. Um, Natalie Portman. She's kind of like, she's kind of like it as far as I'm concerned. Do you have a favorite Natalie Portman movie? I don't know. The Garden State was really good. She's always been really good, even like since like the professional, she was like 10. She was amazing in that. And then um, I really liked her in Black Swan, I liked her in Garden State, I liked her in all of She's very talented. And uh, if you could have anyone play you in a movie, who would it be? Philip Seymour Hoffman. 
original answer. That was wow. <laughs> That's awesome. <laughs> that is awesome. Um, and if I were to say, let's talk about music, what comes to your mind? Who are we talking about? Uh, well, bands. Yeah, bands. bands. Uh, Artists, yeah, people yeah, people who make music. I, <laughs> um, I don't know, like, um, I love music. I'm a huge kind of like uh, uh, music guy. Um, I was really like, I, I got into like, you know, Bowie and a bunch of other like, uh, you know, there's Ricky Lee Jones and like Tom Waits and like that kind of stuff. Like, I got really into that kind of stuff and. I don't know, I love music. I love talking about music. I like music history more than anything. More than anything, I like like the stories that music has created. Like music itself is an amazing thing, but when like you think about bands and like what they're done, like their like their legends and like how bands came together, it's it's really like it's, the stories just keep on. You know, they're just like there's so many stories to to hear and learn about. And it's it's very cool. And I like the way that people like you know, go to school to learn like Roman history. I wish I wish I could, you know, go to school and learn like, you know, musical history. You know, uh, pop pop culture musical history. Just like, you know, sixties bands and all this it took a lot of effort to get all those bands together and it was very weird. Thank interesting, you. interesting oh interesting little story. You know Davy Jones of the who just passed away, the monkeys? David Bowie was called David Jones. But he changed his name to last name to Bowie because of David Jones. Wow. Of the monkeys. That's really interesting. And then David Bowie was, was created. Awesome.